Have you guys noticed how some people have a problem with the very idea that Christ died for the sins of the world? Like how does it make sense that God has to pay back a debt to himself? It is kind of a tricky thing on the face of it. And it's tricky because it was the murderer Cain who came up with the whole plan. The whole concept of man giving something back to his maker, his all-powerful creator who created him and everything, that came from Cain. If you've read the Bible and you've been careful, then you will notice that he was the one who came up with the idea. He's the first man who ever gave something back to God. And it came from a place of sin, and sin doesn't make sense. Sin does not make sense, because the truth is not in it. It's not founded on the truth, so it falls apart. That's why it seems kind of crazy that there's this sacrifice thing happening. It was the murderer who came up with it, and it came from his pride. It's not about jealousy, the story. It's pride that turns into wrath. It's pride, first of all, because Cain reasons he is a great man, and he will give something back to God, and then he will be greater. So he picks up some of the fruits of his labor, this is what God told him to do, and gives it to God. And thinks, this is good now, right? Yeah. Now God rejects him because it came from his pride instead of humility. He accepts the offering of Abel, the worthless little brother who saw his big brother do this, and he thinks, you know, what can I give back to my God? Well, if I'm gonna give him something, I'm gonna give him the best things. I have, which is the firstborn. So Cain never gave the first fruits. Abel gave the firstborn. And uh, because God loves everybody, even people like Cain, there has to be an escape for somebody who is so proud that he can think he can give something to God. A man who is that proud, there has to be an escape for that sin. And Christ is the escape. He is the salvation for this man. That proud man will have to go to the cross and humble himself to become like Christ. And then he can offer himself to God. It does make sense. And it is a uh, way God made this insane thing of sacrificing something to him who doesn't need anything makes sense through his son 